what's going on? Welcome back to another video. This is Modern Day Muscle. My name is Jordan. We got some cars in the lineup. We're on our way to um to the Shinday. Well, the Shinday's on Saturday. Today's the racing event at the drag strip. I think at Silver Dollar Drag Strip. This is the lineup we're working with right now. Probably like, a few Mopars, guys. But yeah, man, this is our uh, first gas stop. We're just gonna um. You know, wait for everybody to get gas, get snacks, and then uh, we're gonna be heading back on the road. I'm gonna try and get some cruise footage. Um, traffic's been a little suspect, but you know, uh, we'll get to it. Here comes another car. CFL Mafia and Tampa Mopar Society, they're out with us today. Show you guys some of the cars. Pretty sure if you guys are on Instagram, pretty sure you guys have seen this car before, the Lightning McQueen joint. Looking crispy. We got the Deadpool joint over here. But yeah, guys, I think everybody's almost ready. Um, let's get back to the road. to eat or whatever but yeah man it was a cool drive five hour drive first time doing a five hour drive got i got 24 25 miles to the gallon so not bad um yeah man uh hopefully you know silver silver dollar raceway doesn't um cancel you know the drag strip event today because um it looks like it's gonna rain but you know we'll only tell it's at six so you know we'll figure it out right now it's pretty early in the day yeah we're gonna get some food i'll look up with y'all in a second Speedway or Dragway. I'll put it on the screen. I don't know what I'm saying. Shout out to all the bugs that's eating me alive right now, but uh, we all made it. This is the lineup right now. We got a couple that's gonna race. We're gonna show some races. Um, I'm gonna try and find some bug spray because uh, this is ridiculous.
what's going on guys good morning it is super early in the morning last time I checked it was um 6 30 or so in the morning we're uh, in a line right now for the southeast shindig the biggest Mopar meet in the south apparently see all the lineup right there we're gonna have a good day it's indoor thank god because <laughs> I didn't want to be in the sun I've been to a lot of meets in the sun and even though I love being at meets, it sucks because there's no shade. So I'm extremely happy that it's indoor. Um, I can't wait to show you guys all these cars. You know, we got Tampa Mopar Society out here and um, CFL Mafia. Oh, there's Joe right there. Joe, say hi. <laughs> but yeah, um, we're just waiting right now. I think we're waiting for the doors to open. So yeah, stay tuned. Look at this car, guys. I don't think I've ever seen this one. Everybody's getting ready. Everybody's getting ready to see this. I was thinking about this mod, guys. I think that's the, uh, the ZL, the ZL add-on diffuser. I've never actually seen it in person. I don't like it. Whose car is this? It's not here. Oh, oh it is. Oh, there it is. Nice car, man. I wanted him to get one for the Challenger, but I've never seen one in person. Easy to put on. Yeah. yeah, I saw two small screws here that go into the plastic. Yeah. And two big ones that go into the chassis. Cool. Yeah, yeah I like it. It look, looks great. And I, I like the car as well. Yeah, a, a name for it or it's just a car? Uh, we were just talking about earlier this week. I think I like the Iron Patriot name for it. The Iron Patriot? Oh, that's sweet. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah, I dig that. I dig that. Yeah, yeah. I may make me a decal and put that on and see how it goes. That's cool. Yeah. Mopar Man 0369, if you want to follow his belt, guys. Really nice. Heading in, guys. I'll catch you guys on the inside. What's going on, guys? We're at the moon. It's indoor. This is amazing. Look at this, guys. The cars are still rolling in. Man, they weren't lying about being a pretty big uh, Mopar event in the South. This is great. Um, gonna get a lot of content in. People are getting set up right now. Yeah, people are getting set up right now. Yeah, it looks good. I hope you guys can hear me. There's a lot of, you know, music playing and stuff like that. But yeah, as you can see, cars are still being staged. What's up, man? This is awesome. Appreciate it. Wow. My name is Jordan, by the way. Sorry. What's that? My name is Jordan, by the way. I'm Jason. Sorry, I just see cars and I, I go crazy. Yeah. This, this is Everybody great, though. See, this is the focal point, and then you know, once they come up there, and they're, oh, hey, you got a flag and everything too. Yeah. yeah, it's awesome. Skeleton. <laughs> the flag, guys. Yeah, yeah. I'm Brian. Jordan. You're on YouTube, by the way. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not even gonna. 
I'm not even gonna put any details for it. I really don't need to, really. Yeah, yeah, it looks pretty good. I mean... The lights on this Magnum look pretty good, guys. So, waiting for some more cars to come in. I think I'm gonna grab a bite to eat. Um, maybe check the car, make sure I, I didn't miss any spots or anything, and then uh, we'll get we'll get back to some more content. I want to wait for some more cars to show you guys, so just stay tuned. A few minutes later. Is this yours? This is his. I call mine a little brother because he's really like the, he's really like the big big ass version of my truck. Oh. <laughs> so the, this one's your truck. That's my truck. Cool. You're on YouTube, by the way. What's up, YouTube? <laughs> <laughs> What's yours thing? Modern day underscore muscle. Yeah, yeah it's, okay. it's my first time That's up here. Crazy. It's pretty cool. Oh, cool. Yeah. And where, where are you from? I'm from Tampa. Tampa? Okay. Cool. Yeah. So it was a five hour drive. It was pretty cool. It's not bad. Yeah, it's yeah not, not bad. bad. That's it's actually my first time driving that far, so I kind of want to do it again. <laughs> yeah, I hear yeah, it's fun. Yeah, it is fun. So let me ask you this: You're a Buccaneers fan? No. Good. I'm uh I'm from Miami, so you know I have Dolphins to. Dolphins fan, baby. <laughs> it's it's uh. I I uh. And he's from North Carolina. <laughs> I have to rap it because that's where I'm from, but I know my place. <laughs> I know my place. Diehard Phillips fan. I was about to say next yeah. weekend is game time for the Buccaneers. <laughs> so um. Uh, tell, let me tell something. When you guys lift the truck, is that because I, I don't know any better? But it's it, a warranty question. No, no, it's not a warranty question. Is it stressful on the transmission, or is that the tires? No, it's not really stressful on the transmission because the transmission doesn't change. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. And honestly, in my opinion, it actually helps. Okay. Because you got now you've got bigger tires to where they'll grip even better. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. But now pulling up a hill. As far as your suspension goes, if you don't have a good suspension when you lift it, then yes, of course, it's going to strain it. Okay. Yeah, we'll say you got to, you definitely got to uh, do the alignment more. Yeah. About every six to eight months, I need an alignment. Okay. And you got to, I know with my truck, I have to get a performance alignment for the lift because if anything, you're, from my, I noticed, uh, like I said, my first six months, I had to get my lift inside of here, we started to start balling. Yeah. Start balling yeah. out. So when I'm so really? truck meet. You're driving a Ram as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're driving. It. So. So here's his diesel. Mine's gas. Yeah. So you save. You save a little bit more. How does that work? I really don't. Well, know. the thing is with diesel. Diesel. Diesel is more expensive. Uh -huh. Obviously at the pump. Right. But the thing about diesel is diesel burns faster and cleaner. So this truck has got a 31 gallon tank on it versus the 1500 is got is it 24 okay yeah 24 gallon tank so even though i hold a lot more but with the diesel burning at the rate that it burns i can get like 430 to 450 miles okay out of a 31 gallon tank of gas That's and of bad. course there again it depends on how you drive as well right 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 but i'm averaging um around town I'm averaging about 13 to 14, and then on the interstate, like interstate set, because I travel at 75 a lot, mm -hmm. I'm averaging anywhere from 17 to 20. It just depends on how you drive. Okay. And with that turbo, that turbo, you can watch your gauge, and obviously, if you're you got your cruise control set, you know your your fuel your fuel is going to be higher as far as your average miles per gallon is going to be higher. Right, right. But right. every time you got to stop and go, stop and go, stop and go, when you engage that turbo, that turbo what? really sucks the gas i see you see what i'm saying so, yeah so that's cool and i've got a turbo gauge and also the fuel gauge that i can see in my thing so it'll let me know how much psi my turbo is pushing out you know and then once it reaches a certain level like if i set my cruise or maintain at a certain speed yeah, yeah. Then my fuel my, my turbo will go all the way off and then my fuel mileage will go all the way to the top mine is a 6.7 okay so in the 6.7 C, you would think that a 6.7 would be a V8, but it's not. Hmm. Even though mine's a 6.7 cubic inch engine, mine is a uh, basically a straight six. Oh wow! Or I, I six, inline six. I'm sorry. Inline six. Yeah, it's okay. called an I six. Okay. So it's actually just a six cylinder engine, but it's just a huge six cylinder engine. Interesting. <laughs> What?
guys. This meat is absolutely crazy. They got all these cars. They got all these cars in here. It's 100 cars inside the building right now, a 50,000 square foot building. Look at that. Yeah, a couple cars. A couple cars didn't make it, so they were able to put them outside too. But yeah, this is um, this is crazy. I didn't think it was gonna be this big. Hey, what's up? It's been a couple days now. Um, the shindig was great. I met a lot of cool people. Um, saw a lot of cool cars, especially that uh, Scat Pack that had a Hellcat motor in it. That was pretty cool. It was a Scat Pack Charger, and um, you know, I met some other car clubs out there. It was really cool. Um, cruising with uh, CFL Mafia and Tampa Mopar Society. That was awesome. I hope to cruise with more clubs in the future. Um, but you know, this video is over. My name is Jordan. If this is your first time to the channel, please subscribe, like, and comment. I would truly appreciate that. Also to our modern day underscore muscle on Instagram. I'll catch you in the next video.